how to send HBAR from exchanges to your ledger. Now there's a couple additional steps because ledger is not natively host HBAR, but I'm gonna show you how to get around that in this video. As you can see, we've already done this. We have $9.94. I'm gonna send this to my Uphold account because I don't have any HBAR on my Uphold currently. So I'll also be showing you how to take profit in the bull run when the time comes. In order to do that, press send, type in your receive address here. In order to do that on HBAR or on Uphold, press transact there at the bottom, select source, type in HBAR, you're gonna select the HBAR network there at the bottom. The address at the top, that is what you're going to type in for the receipt address. It should be a 0.0, .0 number. Press continue. Now you can't really send the max because you need at least one HBAR for transaction. So I'm, I have 195, I'm just gonna send 194. Now, in this case, we're sending it to an exchange, so you do need a memo. When sending it to a ledger, you do not, but typically the exchanges require a memo. Once you've typed that in, press continue. Confirm all the information. Type in your passcode on your device. Confirm it on your device. As you see, these two purple highlighted things, that is how you confirm it. Two clicks. Scroll all the way over on your device with a right click until you see a confirmed check mark and then click at the same time to confirm the transaction. View the details and boom, just like that, it's already on my uphold. Now that is how you take profit when the time comes. For what you guys all came here for, how to set it up on Ledger, you're gonna head over to the web browser. From my experience, Google Chrome works the best. I haven't had too much luck with Firefox. Type in hashpack dot app make sure it's the official website i will leave a link in the description but verify hashpack.app get hashpack you can either launch the web app or install on chrome i already have the web browser up here so i'm just going to launch the web app you're going to connect hardware wallet you can either do ledger or decent we're doing a ledger in this particular case create new wallet connect ledger now, before you do this part, make sure that you type in your password on your hardware device. Make sure it is connected and ready to go. Connect Ledger. I'm going to do Web USB. This means that my device is connected to my PC via a USB cord. Then we're going to need a Get Public Key. People have had trouble with this in the past. Usually, it's because you're not logged in on your device or you're on the wrong web browser. Approve it on your ledger. If you're having trouble with this part, just make sure you're on the HBAR app on your ledger, press back, and then do it again. And then on your hardware device, export public key. You'll see it on your hardware device if you've done it correctly. Approve that on your hardware device with two thumbs again, and this, will, this is how you'll know that you got in. Press next. Give your wallet a nickname. I'm just going to say uh, skeezy. This part doesn't really matter at all. Create wallet. All right, and boom, we're almost there. Now we just need to send the HBAR from our exchange to our ledger. In order to do that, you're going to hit receive down at the bottom. I'm going to scan this with my uphold account. In order to do that, we're going to hit transact again. Select source on uphold. We're going to click our HBAR account that has funds on it already. Select destination. Type in HBAR, scroll at the bottom where it says Hedera Network. Click that. All right, I'm going to do $10, preview withdrawal. Now we're going to hit the little square bottom in the corner so we can scan this. Let it scan. Boom, it's already on my phone. No memo is required because we are sending it to Ledger. Hit next. Confirm withdrawal. If it's your first time sending it to this account, it's probably going to ask you, why are you doing this? Just say, I am sending my phone funds to a non-custodial wallet hit next it's going to caution you about potential scams never ever move your funds because someone's threatening you always verify where you're sending it all that good information this is good stuff you should read but i've already read all this stuff press continue authenticate it on your app all right i counted to nine thousand in my head and it's already back on my account one more step to get it on your actual ledger and again, most of these steps are just a one-time occurrence. Once you set this up on your ledger, you won't need to do half of this stuff. All right, so we're going to go back to our ledger app, hit accounts here, add account, choose crypto asset. We're going to do HBAR, press continue, unlock your device. 
Press retry. Synchronizing up. And... Boom. We're going to name this one H Bar Hedera TikTok YouTube. You can name yours whatever you like. Hit add account. Press done. And there she is, our $10 that we sent, HBAR TikTok slash YouTube. And that is how you set up your ledger for HBAR Custodial. Let me know what you want next and follow me for more, you savages. Hey, I'm hustling, 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 hustling.